Could this be Ford's single most influential model since the Focus? Ford's most recent electric car effort was a third generation Focus fitted with a 23 or 33 kilowatt battery and sold in very small numbers in the US and also in the UK and finally going off sale in Europe in 2017. However this time with a starting price of around about £41,000 the Mustang Mach-E offers a whole new range of possibilities and options to customers. It offers all-wheel drive and rear-wheel drive, standard range or extended range with usable battery capacities of 68 kilowatt and 88 kilowatt. This translates into a range of 273 to 379 miles and a power output of 265 brake horsepower right through to almost 350 brake horsepower. This rapid red example, a 1,150 pound option, really shows the lines of the Mustang off very well. It's clear to see the influence of the Mustang Coupe that all of us know and love and see how well that's been translated into an SUV style vehicle. And I personally believe Ford have really translated their brief well to actually distinguish this vehicle from the rest of their core passenger car range. The vehicle really has a much more upmarket feel and I think will certainly have a huge impact with the Mustang branding. The first point of difference is the e-latch and you can see here to open the doors you press the button and the door will actually unlatch and open slightly. Inside we can see first of all the 10.2 inch full digital cluster and the huge 15.5 inch central touchscreen which really rivals the Tesla. Despite being similar to a Ford Cougar in terms of exterior dimensions and in actual fact very slightly narrower, the vehicle has a pretty large amount of space both front and rear as you can see in this particular shot. No shortage of legroom and in common with almost all electric vehicles you can see rear passenger space with the lack of a transmission tunnel gives the passengers a much more comfortable seating position to have three across the back seat. In the rear boot the vehicle has 502 litres of capacity rising to 1420 litres with the rear seats folded fully flat. Additionally it has some more space up front and we'll talk about that later. There's also some space under the boot floor in the rear to actually store cables and other items. What might be useful to know also is that it has a 750 kilogram towing capacity so it is possible to, to tow a small trailer or maybe even a small caravan with this vehicle. Let's talk briefly about the front boot or the frunk. There's actually a hundred litres of fairly usable space here. In actual fact it's possible to remove the divider which is shown here and actually that would make the space a lot more practical. Also the bonnet under padding is actually hollowed out so you can store quite tall items as well which is very useful. Thanks for joining me on the short walk round of the Ford Mustang Mach-E. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please like, share and subscribe and that will be really appreciated. Look forward to seeing you on the next one.